Hey everyone, Dulce here and you're watching Candy's Garden. If you're interested in seeing an update on her, stay tuned. Alright, so before I take you back to the queen of my picking pepper plants, let's take a look at all the others that I have around my house. This one stands at about 5 feet 8 inches tall and she's at the front of my house. This one is in my front entranceway and she is potted with some elephant ears. This girl is right by the gazebo in the front of my house and she only has a couple of peppers. This little girl is in the pot with my date palm trees and she's got a few peppers. Alright so this is one side of my house and there's one growing in all this mess. Now whenever I clean up all this area she's probably going to go but that's okay because I've got plenty more. Alright here's some in my backyard by the fence and these I believe got pulled out from the bed of the canes that I had in front of last year that I've just kept in pots and this one is actually growing in the ground that we're going to keep so on these guys over here I am probably going to sell or just give away but they're all doing really good with a ton of peppers all right, so what you all have been waiting for, the queen of my Pekin pepper plants, standing at nearly eight feet tall. As you can see, that's a six foot high fence. And she's all around the fence. I'm not even sure how wide she is, but she's a pretty big sized plant slash bush. And she goes all the way around my fence. She goes through it and she's loving this area. Now I keep her trimmed right here because I keep my trash can right there but other than that I don't trim her. I don't trim her anymore. Now back in 2017 in November that's the last uh, Pekin pepper video I did and she was pretty tall back then. But then here comes the snow, which we hardly ever get snow here down in Lockhart, Texas. Um, in December, it snowed, so it kind of fried off her branches and her leaves. So what we did, as long as you keep the roots good and intact, you should be good to go. You can trim it down far. So we trimmed her nearly a foot from the ground. And ever since then, we have not messed with her, besides me trimming the area where I put the trash can. But that was in 2018, the last frost that we had. And ever since then, this is what she's looked like. She's just big and beautiful, giving us a ton of peppers, which we don't really eat anymore. 
I mean, I never really ate any because they're so hot, but my husband, you see them a lot, but he doesn't really eat them anymore just because he's getting older and, you know, acid reflex and everything. Yeah. So we just let her do her thing. We pick them for other people and for seeds, but that is about it. All right, y'all. Hope you all enjoyed this. Love God because he loves you. And y'all have a nice day now. You're here. Bye.